हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू एक्सरसाइज 8.2 एंड वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर टू येस्टरडे वी वर डन विद क्वेश्चन नंबर वन ऑल द पार्ट्स लुक एट द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑन द स्क्रीन टू टेंजेंट थर्टी डिग्री ओवर वन प्लस टेंजेंट स्केयर थर्टी डिग्री देर आर फोर ऑप्शन इन द बुक लेट एस सी विच ऑप्शन विल बी करेक्ट वी नीड टू सॉल्व इन द सेम वे वी लॉन्ट येस्टडे वट इज़ द वैल्यू ऑफ टेंजेंट थर्टी डिग्री टेंजेंट थर्टी डिग्री इज वन बाय रूट थ्री ओवर वन प्लस अगेन टेंजेंट थर्टी इज देयर सो वन बाय रूट थ्री एंड इट्स स्केयर देन इट बिकम्स टू बाय रूट थ्री अपॉन वन प्लस वन बाय थ्री बिकॉज रूट थ्री स्केयर इज थ्री ओनली वट नेक्स्ट विल बिकम इट टू बाय रूट थ्री ओवर थ्री विल बी एल्सियम थ्री प्लस वन देन टू बाय रूट थ्री दिस थ्री विल गो एट टॉप एंड थ्री प्लस वन इट विल रिमेन फोर नाउ सी टू वन जर टू टू जर वी गेट थ्री अपॉन टू रूट थ्री आई होप यू आर क्लियर टिल दिस स्टेप नाउ वी नीड टू रैशनलाइज रूट थ्री अपॉन रूट थ्री वी गेट थ्री रूट थ्री अपॉन टू मल्टीप्लाई रूट थ्री इंटू रूट थ्री वी गेट थ्री सो थ्री एंड थ्री कैंसल्ड our answer is root 3 by 2 if without four options this question comes just to solve our answer will be root 3 by 2 but now in this question we are having various options i am writing options here a option is sin 60 b option given is cos 60 c is tangent 60 and d is sin 30 now we need to select which option is correct we know that root 3 by 2 is the value of sin 60 degree right so its answer is a option i hope you are clear with let us move to next part part second look at the next part 1 minus tangent square 45 degree over 1 plus tangent square 45 degree this is very easy question because value of tangent 45 is 1 so let's put 1 here in numerator as well as in denominator 1 square is 1 so we get this value 1 minus 1 is 0 1 plus 1 is 2 so its answer is 0 right so option d which is given in the book you can check option d is 0 given so it is our final answer so this was very easy question let's move to third part look at part third sin 2a is equal to 2 times sin a is true when a is equal to that means we need to find the value of a see here in left side sin 2a is there right we have not studied yet double of any angle in our previous exercise or till the concepts we have covered now since it's an mcq what we can do just try to put this value here like if i try putting this value of this first portion a value of a as 0 degree what will i get my left side will be sin 2 times 0 degree right 2 into 0 i'll get 0 only and sin 0 degree answer is 0 and my right side 2 times sin 0 that means 2 into 0 and 0 that means value 0 is satisfying my given equation so its answer is a this is one method because directly in exam if mcqs are coming this question can be attempted by just selecting the values you can randomly put all the values whichever satisfies that will be our answer but if you want to exactly solve it sin 2a this formula will come in class plus 1 but let we can learn it now also because this formula is very easy so look carefully sin 2a it is 2 sin a cos a do remember i have told you this is 
this formula you will study in class plus one so what's the formula i'm writing here sin 2a is equal to 2 sin a cos just learn this formula right and our right side is 2 times sin a 2 sin a 2 sin a so dividing by 2 sin a what will we get our left side will be cos a right side will be 1 now what we can do cos a is equal to cos 0 is 1 right so i can write it as cos 0 so this implies angle a must be 0 if i compare left side with the right side so this is the another way you can solve also but if this question comes as a form of mcq you can try putting the values and can get the answer very easily now come to part fourth we are going to start fourth part have a look fourth part is 2 times tangent 30 degree over 1 minus tangent square 30 degree this question is almost same as that of first part we have done today let's put the value tangent 30 is 1 by root 3 1 minus 1 by root 3 square that means 2 by root 3 over 1 minus 1 by 3 so all these steps we have done today 2 by root 3 over 3 LCM 3 minus 1 I'll get 2 that means 2 by root 3 into 3 by 2 I'm just solving it because almost same kind of steps were there 3 by root 3 now root 3 is coming in denominator we need to rationalize we get 3 root 3 over 3 so 3 and 3 cancelled our final answer is answer is root 3 now what four options we are having i'm writing here first option is cos 60 degree we need to select answer out of it second option is sin 60 third option is tangent 60 and fourth option is sin 30 degree so root 3 value is of tangent 60 degree so its answer is tangent 60 i hope you are clear with all the parts of question number second now we are going to start question number three and that question is very important just have a look third question last question of the exercise we are going to do now see third question tangent a plus b is root 3 it is given tangent a plus b is root 3 given and second given is tangent a minus b it is equal to 1 by root 3 we need to find value of a and b so do remember this question is very easy tangent a plus b what we need to do my right side i want to uh, fill as tangent now like root 3 is the value of tangent 60 because my left side and right side i want that both sides same trigonometric ratio should be there and here tangent a minus b 1 by root 3 is the value of tangent 30 degree see now left and right both side tangents are there so what we can do this a plus b can be written equal to this 60 degree and here this a minus b can be written equal to this 30 degree now see we are having two equations we just need to solve it what i can do adding first and second what will i get i'm going to use elimination method here a minus b is equal to 30 degree when i use elimination method i'm going to add so no sign will be changed these two are opposite sign so cancelled so 2a is equal to 90 degree so finally a comes out to be 45 degrees so i hope you are getting it clear it's very easy now put a is equal to 45 degree you can put in any of these two equations i am going to put a is equal to 45 degree in equation number one i get 45 degree 
plus b is equal to 60 degree so value of b comes out to be 15 degree so this question is very easy this kind of question is important also which may come in exam anyways we are done with exercise 8.2 today tomorrow we are going to start next exercise so just subscribe to our youtube channel and click on the bell button as well because every day we are uploading di different videos you will get the notifications immediately thank you so much